name is Damaris Komboka. I am a small business owner. Specifically, I run a coffee shop here in Narok. I come from a family of business owners. Both my parents uh, work in business, they're self-employed. So you can imagine during the holidays when there's nothing much to do, we just kind of help out at the shop. There's a cashier uh, uh, in the office. So over the years, it's just been something that I've been doing. Uh, I can say soon after graduation, you know, reality hits that there isn't that great job waiting for you somewhere. So I don't want to say that it was by default, but it was kind of by default that I found myself here after graduation, working with my parents and helping out. And eventually just uh, planted the seed for me to start my own business. And I really feel it was the best thing that happened to me. As a woman entrepreneur, I can't really say I faced discrimination in the workplace in any way because I can see somebody has stood in my way because I'm a lady. Maybe the main challenge would be finding that work balance between family and the workplace. I think the main thing is to just realize that it's okay to ask for help, whether it's from parents, uh, grandparents, uh, having a house help, there's no shame in it. What motivates me is uh, failure is not an option for me. I think you see the foundation that your parents have laid for you and for them they didn't have that backup for somebody to teach them or guide them, they just did it, the two of them. So for me I feel that there is no excuse at all. But as I mentioned earlier, um, my family is already in business and they've been customers of Ecobank. Uh, my parents have been in business for more than 30 years, uh, so I'd say maybe two decades or more. Ecobank customers, for me personally, five years. I'm so grateful to them. I don't want to say it has made it easier in any way. I've had to make sure that I always balance the books and make sure I remit what is owed at the end of every month. But just taking that leap of faith in me, I think has, I'm so much grateful to them. You know, they say most businesses fail within the, the first three years. We've made it to five, but that's not a reason for us to be complacent or comfortable. For me, mostly the, the last five years has really just been here to make sure that I get it right. You know, the, you don't want to be a jack of all trades and everything is failing. Yeah, you know, pick something and do it well.